Hey guys, welcome back to Solario Entertainment, and I'm back with another review. Today I got that um, seven five three one zero um, called Duel on Mandalore. It goes for twenty dollars in the U.S. and it has one hundred and forty-seven pieces, and it is for ages seven and up. Let's get right into this review. You can recreate the scene um, where Maul flies out of the window. Just like that and if you go on to the back you can put that back up and it'll be like if nothing happened and um, down here there's like a little space that's supposed to be secret and you can just store a gun or whatever there I actually think that's a neat little feature and um, this thing is like where Maul um, is kept prisoner and you can actually fit a mall in there, and I think it's pretty cool. If you open it up like that. You close it up. It looks pretty accurate. Um, one thing I want to do is I want to put like um, some light in there, so it looks just like in the show. Let's put it over there. And overall, it's a pretty nice design. I like the chair right there. I like these pieces that they use, it looks very accurate. And here's the back side underneath. Pretty cool. And let's move on to the figures. We get Ahsoka Tano, same as um, seen last year. And we also get Darth Maul. Let me see if I can get him out. And he's missing his lightsabers right now. Need to get them real fast, and um, they're both pretty nice figures. This is a brand new mall for this year, and it's a very accurate one. I would have been very sad if they used um, the episode one mall, although that is a pretty nice figure. But I honestly like this one better than the episode one mall, and it's gonna be a pretty um, cool addition to my collection. Or should I say, a fine addition to my collection. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.